The evolution of cellular network architectures in the 5G era is creating new opportunities for industry players that can play key roles in supporting the mobile operators as they transition to next generation systems. Well, to find out more, I'm talking today with Taiji Doi, 5G business promoter in the Global Business Promotion Office of the Telecom and Utility Business Sector at NTT Data. So Taiji, great to talk with you today. Thanks very much for joining us. Um, so can you just tell us about NTT Data? What role is it playing in the 5G network sector? Oh, yes, yeah. NTT Data as a system integrator. We bring together the best of breed hardware and software to implement the open and virtualized network in the multi vendor environment. This is the market demanding we, we recognize. And we also provide advisory services to the customer for implementing the scalable and best fit network solutions. And what can the market expect NTT data to contribute to the 5G network sector in this critical systems integration role? Okay, so yeah, it's a very good question. So we, NTT data have been running in and the business in IT industry for more than 30 years. So we uh, have a lot of experience and capability in the IT industry. So by using this uh, experience and the capability, uh, we can provide open and virtualized network using products from multiple vendor while ensuring interoperability between them. Also, uh, we, as one of the leading system integrator, NTT data accumulate a deep understanding of deployment on cloud platform through various IT projects. We will leverage uh, this understanding and experience to implement open and virtualized networks in the cloud, and the cloud environment. And also, we, NTT data, as a member of the NTT group, so we will contribute by uh, leveraging the vast experience and knowledge of working with our sister companies in NTT groups uh, as our value add proposition to buy a CSPs. And also, uh, we also see many opportunities for utilizing the 5G connectivity in many industry verticals, where we also have many years of experience uh, by partnering with CSP, uh, we can integrate and provide the power of 5G connectivity and our applications together to our client. Okay, well, that's that's very important to bring that experience from, from other sectors uh, into uh, telecoms. Uh, can you just tell us a, a little bit more about NTT Data's role within the broader NTT group? Yes, okay. So, uh, also in the 5G network business, we are a member of OREC. Uh, OREC is the Docomo 5G Open Run Ecosystem founded by NTT Docomo. This is a sister company uh, in 2021. In OREC, uh, NTT Docomo plans to uh, validate the interoperability between the hardware and the software of top global vendors. Uh, since many vendors in the OREC are uh, hardware and software vendors that provide 5G open run, open network technologies, NTT data uh, provides the strength as a multi vendor system integrator to integrate or orchestrate the 5G open network technologies provided by these global vendors to build the test and the problem combination of 5G open network environment. And uh, NTT Data is also collaborating with NTT Docomo for global business expansion of open and virtualized 5G network. Uh, NTT Data will provide the necess necessary resources located globally to deploy open and virtualized 5G network to any part of the world. So, and finally, the NTT Data is also the uh, is also an essential part of part of long term and ambitious strategy led by NTT. This is our mother company uh, 
to revolutionize the network hardware, uh, we strongly believe that the hardware and software must be decoupled to facilitate the research and development of next generation hardware. MTT data will leverage the network uh, knowledge and experience acquired through uh, integrating open and uh, disaggregate network in the other uh, direction to achieve to achieve this goal. Okay, great. Now, um, what is NTT Data's view on the use of 5G open networks in industry verticals? Uh, do you have any thoughts on which industry sectors might benefit the most? Okay. Uh, all industry verticals will benefit from the use of 5G in their ICT environment. The demands of each industry vertical are very different and they also uh, differ from region to region. Uh, you can imagine that there are a lot of the uh, situation, the dense urban area and the urban area and the rural area. And also that there are a lot of the industry. So uh, we are not able to compare them up to up and say uh, who will benefit the best. But uh, I think you can imagine easily the this is the one good example is the autonomous driving, autonomous driving. So, uh, and, uh, by using the, uh, in the autonomous driving era, so we don't need to, to drive ourselves, but, uh, 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 vehicle itself drive. So therefore, uh, we don't need to care about the driving, like uh, we don't need to uh, control the steering wheel and the uh, uh, axle pedal and the brake pedal. So in this situation, we have a lot of the time to uh, to, to to enjoy, the, like the entertainment, like the uh, watching the movie and uh, chatting each other and uh, uh, doing the uh, XR, uh, VR, AR devices. So. Uh, there are a lot of the opportunity in the, all of the industry vertical, and this is just one example, but uh, we have a lot of the ex opportunities, and also that in order to uh, bring our technology and our experience to the most important thing is what is happening in each industry's vertical. Okay, well, that, that sounds like a, a very exciting future. Uh, Taiji, it's been great to hear about NTT Data's role in 5G today. Thanks very much for joining us. Thank you very much.